Hello guys, welcome to my channel. So whenever you start your computer, if you are receiving this prompt which says SS3SVC32.exe. So whenever you start your computer, you see this prompt and if you want to get rid of this, then please follow the steps shown in this video. So go ahead and visit this link. The link is provided in the video description. So open this link in a browser and then click on download auto runs and auto run SC. Click on it. A exe file will uh, a zip file will download you have to go ahead and click on this uh, arrow and then click on show in folder go to the download location now you have to go ahead and extract this folder so make a right click then click on extract to auto runs now if you don't see the extract option over here then in that case you have to go ahead and download this winrar so copy this link and then open this link and then go ahead and download this download winrar this is free so click on download winrar once you click on download winrar now this time when you make a right click on auto runs you will be able to see the extract option so here click on extract to auto runs and then you have to go ahead and open this auto runs folder and then you have to go ahead and run auto run or auto run 64 so you can go ahead and run make a right click then you have to run is uh, run it as an administrator so make a right click on auto run 64 and then make uh, click on run as administrator then click on yes to allow and then you have to go ahead and find anything you have to go ahead and find anything which is related to ss3 svc32 so you can go ahead and copy this just copy this name and then paste it in the filter box on the top here and then anything related to ss3 svc 32 will pop up over here so right now in my case it's not there so in your case it will be there then you have to select it then make a right click and delete that particular entry so for example i'll show you this is just an example i don't have that uh, entry so just uh, select that so once you paste the ss3 svc if you find any entry over here then make a right click and then click on delete just make a right click and click on delete and this is just an example i don't have that entry right now so paste it over here then find it anything related to ss3 svc make a right click and then delete it and after you delete it go to the start menu and then click on the power icon then click on restart and after the system restart that should go ahead and fix that error you should not be receiving this prompt and you know whenever you start you can be so that will be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel